Hi, my name is Femke buysman pelman and I'm a senior lecturer in the, uh, at the University of Adelaide. My research mainly focuses on understanding the individual differences in addiction. So why does one person respond very strongly to drug? Um, why do they become addicted while other people use uh, on and off for a long time without developing that real addictive behaviour? I've seen a lot of change in the time that I've been in addiction research, uh, where understanding of the biological basis behind addiction really has changed. Initially it focused a lot about dopamine and opioids and the stress system came in, but now there are so many players that we need uh, to focus on because addiction is a very complex disease and we found that there's not just one thing that can explain it or one target that we can use to, uh, to treat it. So we've learned that the immune system is important, that there are lots of neuropeptides uh, and my main research focus at the moment is understanding the role of oxytocin, which is the cuddle hormone, and really understanding how it might be protective uh, in addiction and might provide a new avenue for treatment of addiction. So this is something that really focuses on understanding how uh, early childhood um, experiences and especially adverse experiences might change the way our brain develops and especially how the oxytocin system is involved in this and how that might set you up to be more sensitive to addiction.